Previously on The Potentialists. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Nah! It's got to be because you had me on plate. I don't know how to resolve it. Me and Alexa actually went to uh, junior high school together, so... Too cute! Let's go party! Anyone can entertain you, but only we edutain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Get ready to make it happen. So Miles got stranded. Supposedly, we had already just put in a brand new battery. And now, it seems like we gotta go buy another battery. So, the girls are now attempting to buy a motorcycle battery. Have you ever bought a motorcycle battery before? Yeah. Me either. And after picking a battery, the girls embarked on their mission to rescue the guys from an unknown situation. I have no idea what happened. You gotta find out the details, man. You know what? I never ask details for anything. I go into action, and then after things <laughs> are called, then I reflect and I'm like, okay, so what happened? What are the details? He's under a tree. These heels don't work well with this kind of terrain. Which tree is he under? Oh, there he goes. We're in heels. It's not happening. He is meditating. And while Bert meditated, Miles set to replace the battery on the bike, which was made all the more difficult in the sweltering summer heat. <laughs> I feel like I'm medium well right now. <laughs> you brought Miles a Hello Kitty cup? <laughs> you see, Audrey? Never dull. Never dull, man. No, it isn't. <laughs> You are from Hialeah, dude. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Man, Miles, I take care of you, honey. There we go. So, where's the battery? Thank God. We're gonna find out. You're missing the whole thing. You're missing uh, our Hialeah friend. I'm gonna get burned. And once the battery had been replaced, everyone settled back into their seats and got back on the road. But not long after... Ran out of gas! Aren't you not supposed to be drinking monsters? No. no. Here, let's trade. Mango, carrot, or monster. Let me taste it. Yeah, he's not supposed to be drinking monsters. And after refueling their bodies with energy drinks... How you feel? I'm gonna put it good back here with the gas. Yeah! <laughs> the girls brought the gasoline... To Miles. She has gas high. <laughs> so now Miles ran out of gas in another part of town. Luckily, mom came with a gas tank too. They didn't ask me for it, but I don't know. I guess I'm in the quantum or something. It hasn't been my day today. How far does that take you? It's just taking pretty far. No, I mean, like, do you need to stop at the gas station again? I wouldn't fill it up. Okay. Cost like an extra five bucks. There's an old man there laughing at me. And then I'm like, how far is the next gas station? He goes, it's that flag there. I turned on the bike and I turned it off real quick, so it turned on. So I turned it on and I gassed it and I flew down here and then a car got in front of me again and I had to stop him and get into this pool here. All right, now let's see if we can get to our next place. What happened now? They are not in the quantum, they're not in, they're not in the planet, they're not in Miami. I don't know where the hell they are. They're we stopped the for gas because they told me they needed gas and we stopped at the first gas station in the corner of where we were at and they kept going. Speedy. And I don't think they even know where they're going. Hey, yo, how you doing? Check this out, it's Serge from Bowl World. You better like us. And if you got something to say, leave a comment. And check this out, if you really got the guts, subscribe so I can get back to you so we can make it happen with Bowl World. Feel me?